all right what up everybody welcome back to the channel it's your girl Jeannie and you already know what it is so let's just get into the energy because you already know I got a song for you today and I got a page full of notes okay the song is sun moon and herbs okay uh, and the lyrics that really stuck out to me was our planet is in retrograde so when I heard that in the lyrics of the song it started correlating with my cards right so I added it to my notes and I looked up which planet is in retrograde right now and the planet in retrograde is in Uranus right that got me going through all the rest of the planets that will be retrograding this year um but right now it's in Uranus and Uranus rules over Aquarius energy. Okay, so there's something here about like the downfall of an Aquarius, the downfall of somebody who has some type of control, wheel of fortune energy. Something is retrograding, something is changing, a shift in your favor, somebody is losing control. And I knew that because the next song, I kid you not, like the next song that pops up on my list is portrait of tracy and i'll leave that down in the comments below but it's basically an instrumental and it started aligning with my notes again right in my song jazz in my notes it says jazz beats instrumental vibes right and then an instrumental came up next and in the instrumental it's the instrumental to the song rain down on me let your love come shining through just rain on me it's the instrumental to that and I started singing the song, rain down on me, like blah, blah, blah. And I got to the part where it says, and then I lose all control. So I already know, I already know, like, there's some type of control. There's some type of uh, shift in alignment. There's some type of whatever somebody was doing for control that is coming to an end. Somebody's reign is over. Their reign of tyranny, their reign is coming down, okay? And now somebody is crying like they made other people cry in other seasons. Something's coming back around. And if somebody loses and is raining and crying and mourning, we're being rained on, right? It's metaphorical. They're raining down tears because the first song talks about crying and the tears, right? And then the next song was talking about rain down on me as they lose control. So I feel like there's somebody, there's somebody or something, Aquarius energy, Uranus energy, the age of knowledge here, where the control is being taken from someone. Okay, too many people know about it. Too many people know how to protect themselves from it. Okay, so this is giving me the energy. I'm at 303, it just turned 301. Whole bunch of synchronicities, but what I'm getting is like, there's too many people who know Okay, they they don't need companionships to fulfill them anymore. They don't need lovers. They don't need people raining down on them. They, they're cool with being celibate. There's too much protection going on for some type of scheme or plot to continue. Yeah, somebody caught on camera too. And they're about to snitch on everybody. All right, and we're going to see who's all linked in on some shit. We're going to see all the links to the missing pieces okay in order to have these people stay in control they had to be connected to companions in the legal system or who had control and when this information comes out you're going to be very shocked and surprised but they're going to be people who have already said some shit so this is giving me the energy this is giving me the energy of People who say it, but they're the ones who did it, okay? If you were listening to, to somebody and you're like, you're projecting, you did that, and that's why you feel like I did that. This is that type of energy. So there could be like a news channel, a company, a business that, that say things like, uh, uh, something's going on, we should all look out for this and that, and they're the culprit, gee, they're the ones who's doing it. All the meanwhile, thanking God, you feel me, that they're not like us, the one that uh, is being taken from. Yeah, they, they were thankful until the police got onto them. 
Okay, they were thankful until they got caught wind of the trail of the things that they were creeping and doing in the woods at night. You feel me? And this all came about because love of the highest vibration. You started loving yourself. Uh, the love, the vibration of love grew stronger. This is giving me the energy of prayers against something. Okay? But anyways, there's going to be some some shit that come out. There's more people on camera, more people connected, more people who was talking about something before it happened. And it's going to be real weird that they were talking about it um, and then got uh, caught up in it. It's going to be real weird when that comes out. But I digress. Let's just get into the energy. Let's see what's coming out here because that's really all my intuitive notes. Like, I don't know what's going on. Okay, I don't know what's going on for real. All they're saying is some corporation, some control is losing control. All right, what's going on for Virgo energy today? The weekend. Okay. <clears throat> Mystic woman, something could take place on the weekend. What's today? Really, this is crazy. I made a long ass password for my phone and now I can't even see what today is. Monday, Jesus. Something may have happened over the weekend, this past weekend. Okay, endurance, Scorpio energy. Capricorn energy. What's going on on the weekend? Something about sun, moon, rising as well. The song talks about uh, sun and the moon. And then herbs is giving me smoke rising. There go Aquarius again. I told you. There's something going on with Aquarius over the weekend. What's this energy? Egotism and Leo energy. And, Leo energy. and then escape. Yeah, somebody was really in their ego. We have escape, flirtation, and influence, exhaustion. So somebody was able to make an escape, okay? They flirted with their influence because they were exalted, but they lust got them doing something impulsive. Somebody did something and is birthed authority, defense, and riches, domination here, resourceful, concentration, inspiration, and independence. I'm also getting like, anyways, okay? Let's just see. What's going on here with the weekend energy? Somebody. Uh-uh. What's going on here with the weekend? The hermit. Yep, something was investigated. The higher fin in reverse. Something's being looked into. Somebody may have ghosted someone on the weekend. Uh, somebody could also be a doctor. What's the hermit card here? And the two of swords. The seven of cups. Indecisive. A high priestess in the reverse. The six of cups. Somebody was able to use their influence to trick people in the past. Two of Swords. What's the Hermit to the Two of Swords here? And then the Ace of Pentacles. The Devil. The Five of Cups. The Five of Wands. The Page of Cups. The Queen of Pentacles. The Three of Wands. The Moon. <clears throat> somebody here has been like investigating they've been looking into something because with the two of swords energy i feel like somebody is still undecided about some type of ace of pentacles energy with the devil the five of cups and the five of wands energy It's 
given me that they obligated themselves to something and they regret doing something. Five of Wands energy. Because there's attention or it's drawing attention. Conflict. They really tested the boundary here. Why is the Two of Swords here in the middle? The Page of Pentacles. The Two of Wands. The Seven of Wands. What the fuck? They're undecided about giving you some type of money or... Some type of new beginning here because with the Page of Pentacles or the Two of Wands... They'll know you'll make plans or you're making plans. Or they're undecided about some type of money opportunity in the future here. Oh, what's the fucking Ace of Pentacles? The Four of Pentacles in the reverse. The Page of Swords. Yeah, somebody has the, the Queen of Swords. A boundary here. The King of Pentacles, the Knight of Cups, and King of Wands. <laughs> the Two of Wands. So there's somebody in their ego who's still undecided about doing something. They keep spying on your future plans through divination on your future plans. They're still undecided about some type of Ace of Pentacles energy. All right, with the Ace of Pentacles, we have something here with the Four of Wands, Four of Coins in the Rivers. Which gives me the energy of somebody... Feeling like they may have to pay you something. Because you won't be deceived by them and they're heartbroken here. Yeah, the Tower and the Seven of Wands. This is giving me the energy of somebody knowing they have to give you something. But giving you something would make them lose. Because they can't fool you and they can't trick you because you're the Queen of Swords. So they're undecided about giving you what, you what they owe out of egotism because then you'll get some type of money here. So somebody is undecided about paying you some money that they may owe you because they'll take a loss because you aren't playing with them, with the Queen of Swords. You're not going to fall for no type of scheme. They're not smarter, you, smarter than you, but they're in their ego trying to figure out a way to do something what are they trying to figure out the ace of swords yeah that's truth the ace of wands what are they trying to figure out <laughs> the eight of cups a successful way to walk away four of cups yeah they they do not want to pay you they don't want to pay you i heard a clean break here ace of swords eight of cups What, what are they trying to achieve? The hang one? The ten of wands in their race? They're trying to get rid of the burden here. They're trying to get rid of the burden. They, they, they created some type of false scheme in the past. Went forward on some type of plan. Okay, it was living la vida loca. You feel me? Until shit turned upside down because spirits started judging their ass. You feel me? And now this person working hard over the clock. To conflict and come in and, and fight and uh, bring about some type of reunion with you. But you don't want to be with them. You don't like them. You're not attracted to them. You see them as uh, egotistic. Or they think you're in your ego. But either way, you don't want them. You, don't, you never did. You never did. 
if somebody can't fool you, they can't escape this with motherfucking flirtation and influence no more. Nah. Other people may exalt this person for their lust. And that's why they impulsively got somebody pregnant, thinking that they had authority or something. Think they can dominate somebody's resources. Some weird shit, bro. But this is being seen by the public and they being seen as a motherfucking extremist. And somebody don't like being seen that way. They don't like being seen naked. Okay, they don't like being seen as a narcissist. They don't like everybody knowing they dirt, Virgo. <laughs> So intuition, adaptability, and manipulation negotiation. So they're trying to find a way to negotiate and not pay your money, go to courts, be seen, have their whole lies and schemes put out. What's crazy is somebody did something. Somebody did something to you to make you lose, to make something happen to you, to burden you in some motherfucking way. And they didn't believe in you. They didn't believe in your intuition. They didn't believe in your magic. They didn't believe in God. And they were wasting their own time. And now this bitch about to be moved out the way. Because you've been working too hard for too long. And now you're back here. And somebody is realizing that this was just a trap. It was a trap to plot and scheme against you. Whoever this is thought that they was going to roll in with some type of temptation. Nah, they're experiencing real death out here. Because what? You're a motherfucking wizard. And every time you touch, you get this feeling. You feel me? Because the ancestors and guides are here. In your home. Here with you. This person may be gay as fuck. And that's why it's too late. Because you don't want them. You don't do gay dudes. Okay? You don't do pink panthers and shit. Regardless, somebody's trying to find a way to walk away. Walk away scot-free. Yeah, somebody been waiting a long time to find a way to unload their burdens, but it's just been overbearing them the more that they have put into some type of scheme and try to change appearances and shit. A whole dummy. What's the seven of pentacles? The moon card. Schemes to try to confuse people so they ain't got to pay. They ain't got to tell the truth. They ain't got to lose money. They ain't got to be seen as the narcissist that they are. They just, they, this is stupid. This is stupid. Nine of pentacles. Yeah, it's a... To make people doubt you, Seven of Swords. What's the Nine of Pentacles to the Seven of Swords? The Two of Cups. This person here wanted to get, they wanted to trick you with this relationship. They thought that they can trick trick you with 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 with, with motherfucking uh, mutual feelings and shit. What is this? The Page of Swords. The strength card, the king of wands, the knight of cups, the eight of swords. Yeah, but they see your strength here. Or this is somebody looking, trying to prepare themselves to get strength to come towards you and get out of their head. Six of wands, king of swords, the seven of wands. Okay. But you ain't playing no games with this person. You've already let it know that you don't give a fuck. You never did. They're going to have to run you that money. Everybody going to know their business. You got every single receipt with the hermit. You got every receipt, every message sent. All that. Somebody, somebody is going to be successful no matter what. But this person is still thinking that they can come towards you. And they plan. They plan to go. It's going to go straight in the trash, G. So I don't know what this is. Okay, somebody was uh they gained some type of control. They were using an Aquarius. Okay. Uh, you could have Aquarius in your chart. What's the uh what's the Aquarius aspect here? Who's the Aquarius in this scenario? <clears throat> the two of cups. This person may have got with somebody, okay. To help solve their problems. The page of cups. The eight of wands in the reverse and the four of wands, G. An Aquarius was somebody, a friend that they took they took action with this person. They gave him some type of offer. Eight of wands in the reverse. That shit backfired. Four of wands. Somebody's still solid here. We have the knight of cups, the king of cups, the seven of pentacles. Yeah, somebody this person dated. to. They invested in this person to try to release a burden. But they they regret that shit because the Queen of Swords said that they gonna have they gonna lose G, 
It's a lose lose. Somebody could have got a lawyer. <laughs> Somebody could have talked to a lawyer and realized they're going down, G. <laughs> they're going fucking down. Okay. What's the four wands? This is funny. Moon. High Priestess in the reverse, G. The Seven of Cups. Somebody really tried to confuse people about you, about your home, your foundation, all that. The Nine of Coins, but you stay solid as this person attacks you. Four Swords energy. The Seven of Cups. What's that? The sun. <laughs> What's that? The Emperor in the reverse and the Temperance. Okay. This person went ham in a paint to try to expose or try to do something. There's somebody on your side, though. The King of Swords to the Sun card, the Emperor to the Temperance energy. Somebody was trying to solve their problems. Okay. But with the King of Swords to the Sun card, somebody's going to solve this problem for you. We have the emperor in the reverse because somebody is acting like a whole bitch. All in their ego, like a little baby tantruming, trying to force some shit because they don't want to be seen as who they are. So divine intervention. What's the king of swords to the sun? The page of pentacles. Somebody keeps getting, somebody keeps getting fucking readings from an Aquarius who keeps telling them something. This Aquarius is telling them that you're happy, you're still good, something is still going to be successful for you, and this person mad about it. Mad that you stay balanced, that something is going to balance out here, and they keep getting readings and doing something foolish. What's the Page of Pentacles and the Fool in the reverse? What are they doing? <laughs> the Chariot and the Devil. Somebody's gonna, the police may come after them for some type of uh, shit that they're doing here. Yeah, they regret it. They regret investing in whatever they did over and over and over again, but they still here investing, looking at it. Somebody regrets uh, moving, doing something foolish to do something toxic to you because they're gonna go to jail for that shit. Over the weekend, somebody could have said something to them that made it very fucking clear. <laughs> okay so it's gonna be the downfall of somebody who thought that they had so much control okay thought that they were they were the tyrant the big cock of the block okay thought they were the number one uh the number one man out here with the biggest kahunas could use their influence and trick everybody and scheme everybody like they like they usually did could have used the pisces their mama to try to help them some older ugly woman all that shit going back. Somebody could be Aquarius Pisces energy. An old dirty woman who they tried to use to make some shit go down. And it didn't work. And it's not gonna work. <laughs> and now somebody getting caught up, baby. They're getting caught up. Okay, what does this have to do with Virgos? If this person's gonna get caught up, they found out something over the weekend, they all crushed and shit. <laughs> what is this information gonna do for Virgo? Oh, you gonna be real happy. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yes, ma'am. What is this information gonna do for Virgo? The high priestess. You already know what it is. You already know. Be the temperance and the emperor here. Upright this time. G2 of swords in the world card. The nine of pentacles. Ain't got no choice. Indecision over. You got to do something. You got to take action. You got to pay me this money. Okay. With the high priestess to the temperance to the emperor energy Virgo. You already know some shit is being fixed. Being held. Spirit is tempering out someone's. Spirit is like fixing someone here. What's the temperance of the emperor here? And we have the fool coming out. And the seven of swords. And the four of wands. The six of cups and the page of swords. The wheel of fortune. <clears throat>
So you already know here, okay, with temperance, you chose the middle ground when this person chose to take deceptive action back in the past, G, four of wands and the six of wands, which all was in a relationship, okay? You could have been in a relationship with this person. You could have lived with them, been in the same community, grew up with them, did something. You had some contact with this person in the past. And you remained balanced because you already knew what it was here. When this person was taking action and lying to your face back in the day, you already knew what it was. With the Page of Swords, the Wheel of Fortune, the Seven of Coins, this is the Three of Wands to the Moon card. You peep something or someone peeps something that changed things in your favor, okay? And what changed things into your favor is what you invested in during the wait period, during the confusion, okay? Somebody... Somebody took action to deceive people about your foundation in the past to make things go in their favor. They invested in something, expecting everybody to be confused, expecting to trick everybody. Yes, somebody thought they were smart. A dummy thought they were smart. <laughs> the Page of Pentacles and the Star card in the reverse. There go down Aquarius and the King of Cups and the Six of Swords, G, and the King of Swords. The three of so the two of cups, the three of swords, and the hermit. Mm, mm, mm. This person could have no. You already know what this person did. That's why you remain balanced when this man went and got into a relationship with somebody he didn't even like in the past, just to this is that shit earlier. The Aquarius is the person. Was he in a relationship with a man? Anyways, the Aquarius and whoever this man is, the emperor, you feel me? When they were upright, they went and got into a relationship with somebody else. Okay, to create false appearances. Expecting to confuse this person. But with the start, but somebody here did some type of divination. Okay, they were investing in some type of divination. And with the star card in the reverse here, they were like living in some type of fantasy. All to stay calm and move to a better place and solve their problems by getting into a relationship. But that ended because something is being investigated. Even Either the, the king of swords knows the truth about this person now Okay, there's an Aquarius who knows the truth about somebody and now they're depressed. They know they were in a fantasy. They were tricked by whoever this emperor was. Or these people got into a relationship in order to confuse an investigator, to confuse a hermit, and they are not confused. They are not confused here. Because there's somebody with the Six of Swords or the King of Swords. There's somebody here. They keep popping up who thinks logically is a problem solver. You can't trick this person. What's the Six of Swords to the King? The Nine of Wands and the Strength card, G. The Two of Pentacles. Yeah, somebody here is fucked up. The Five of Pentacles. Somebody may have used... They may have tried to bribe somebody. Something that somebody did caused you some type of exhortion here. And it's like... I heard grounds for something with the strength card. It like... Hyped something up. It grew something. Two of Pentacles and made somebody take a decision to come forward to come check some shit out. Yeah, they did something in their ego. They did too much. Somebody did too much in the past. Got a whole relationship. Got a bunch of people involved. Lied to people. All to, all in their ego. Really thinking that they were going to win or some shit. And you already know what it is. That's why you stayed calm about, about this energy. Okay, but now somebody, they did too much.
Damn. This is giving me the energy of somebody getting into some type of relationship. Okay, and then they money running out. Something here. So they can't pay people or pay somebody to keep up some type of confusion. So somebody has to walk away. Death and the devil. Now something's coming back on somebody. They regret it. Queen of Swords, Four of Swords. Nine of Coins, Two of Swords. <laughs> Queen of Cups, Nine of Swords. Not, somebody just worried. They want to come towards you because they're worried about the legal system and the justice system and losing their job. And uh, Oh my gosh. Losing their job and their empire and their reputation. That's what it is. Okay. Let's get it. Show me who's involved here. A pathological liar. Look, there you go to Aquarius, Gemini. Look, very honest Aquarius. Pathological liar, Gemini. I don't even know what the fuck to say about that shit. This, uh, and a Taurus. Somebody could be a Gemini Taurus. You feel me? In love. <laughs> so if somebody was lying, lying on you being two faced, you feel me? And there's one very honest person or something. What's very honest with Aquarius energy? The four coins upright. Okay. What's very honest? The seven of pentacles. The emperor and the judgment here. The temperance. Yeah, somebody uh, either held back from some type of bad investment and judged an emperor. They were judging the fuck out of this person. What's the emperor to the judgment here? The Queen of Cups, the Queen of Swords, the Six of Pentacles, the Five of Pentacles, and the Ace of Wands. So there was an Aquarius here who held back from a bad investment that an emperor was doing uh, to judge a Queen of Cups, Queen of Swords energy. So they wouldn't have to pay somebody. What's the six of coins to the five of coins? The page of cups. What's the six of coins to the five of coins? Page of cups, the magician, and the ace of swords. The ten of swords. Uh, hear me out. The Aquarius could have told this person not to do this shit. They could have told this person that you, Queen of Cups, Queen of Swords. They could have they could have told this person about you or a Queen of Cups, okay? And they, the Queen of Swords, the Queen of Swords is the Aquarius is telling this person something because they paid them to. They told them after paying them that they lacked what they had to do some type of magic. But they did it anyways. They told them that they lacked what they had to manifest something. Maybe the Aquarius said that they can do it. What's that mean? We have the King of Wands trying to pop out. What's that mean? The Ten of Wands. And the Fool. So with the uh, 
Okay. Okay. So somebody here went to an Aquarius. I feel like this is like a practitioner or like a tarot card reader or somebody who has some type of authority, right? And the Aquarius was, was honest. They told them, look, the best way to do something is to get right with this person. They told them they lack what they need to do some shit. The best way is to apologize. And this is how you're going to get through to this person. But that action was too hard because somebody was in their ego. They didn't want to apologize. That's crazy. So now they did all this shit. Three of Pentacles. What's pathological liar and Gemini energy? I'm getting another song by Rihanna. Ooh, baby, it's raining, raining. Ooh, baby, come in to me. But... What's pathological liar and shit? The chariot and the justice. Okay, they told they ass. You lack what they lack what you have to to create something. Lack what they have to create what? Five of Pentacles to the Ace of Wands, the Eight of Coins, some type of work here. Something would be too much hard work. The Hermit. <laughs> the Nine of Pentacles, the Knight of Cups, and the Four of Swords. The page of wands. They did some type of work that their work wasn't strong enough. It wasn't strong enough, Virgo. These people been doing some type of work on you. And that shit wasn't strong enough. You feel me? Either they tried to send somebody to come towards you and it was short lived, or they tried to trick you in some type of way. You're not having sex with somebody. They they didn't they did something where they could not get you. They could not catch you up. You're too strong for something. They're too weak. And somebody told them that shit. Pathological liar and Gemini, the chariot to the justice. Two of wands. <laughs> the police right now. Three of Cups, the Five of Cups, and the Page of Pentacles, G. Somebody got, they listened to it. Oh, oh. The Aquarius is going down with them, aren't they? And the Aquarius is trying to escape what they did. They were in communication. They were in cahoots with this person. They may have even gave them money, did divination readings about you did something they were involved so the aquarius who was very honest who told the police <laughs> they were very honest to the police gee that's why everything is upright about some type of liar here they ratted on them this is giving me a whole rat energy a whole fucking rat. What's going on in this situation? Show me clearly. Let's get the fuck up out of here. They ratted on him. You look so dumb right now. Didn't I just say something about Rihanna? Is she a Pisces? In flow state, smiling ear to ear. And you over here still in flow state, smiling ear to ear. They really thought they were strong. Yeah. They really thought they were going to be stronger than you. <laughs> but everything that they were doing was being watched by who? By the police, G. The Popo. Something may have happened in 2003, but whatever they did was the last motherfucking straw. Now they can't confuse nothing. Now they can't heal things. Now they can't fix anything. They being flooded out. Flooded out. Okay. They taking out the rats. Then I tell you, you ratted on them. Head <laughs> nod confirmation. This is what I got. This is what I got here for you, Virgo. They're going to tell on each other. They're going to end up telling on each other. And it's going to create a link. And there's going to be a whole lot of people involved. And they're going to be like, and I told you in the beginning, 
somebody's gonna be like, if you already knew and you was a part of it, why were you talking about it then? Somebody was talking about this. There's evidence of something. <laughs> and then they get online or they get on podcasts, they get on the phone and they're like, did you hear about this and that? Knowing damn well they were a part of it. So when it comes out that they were linked in to a pathological liar, they're going to have to rat on each other. <laughs> Downfall of these fools. Gee, so. They were doing something. They were connected to you in some type of way. This could have been somebody you dated at your job, workplace. Somebody just plotting and scheming on you. You were involved in a plot and scheme. And because they brought you in, somebody who's at a high vibration, who smile and gets in flow state, smiling in the ear to ear, the love of the highest vibration energy. I told you, those were prayers you were sending out, praying and rebuking the enemy every single day. <clears throat> and they really thought there was in their ego winning out here until something retrograded. Yeah, so I'm going right back. Now what? Now they got a snitch on each other. This is the energy I got for you today, Virgo. At the end of all this snitching, what is this? What is what's gonna happen for Virgo, please? Because oh, hold on. <clears throat> And the sun, <laughs> we have the death card in the reverse. Something ain't over, G. Some card, something ain't over until some type of uh, thing is exposed, until you succeed, until you're happy and you're protected. Okay, with the death card in the reverse, G, there could have been somebody here who was <clears throat> trying to stop you from moving on. Or trying to stop the ending to something. Hanging on to the brass or refusal to leave you alone. I feel like Virgo, somebody who was refusing to leave you alone out of egotism. They were refusing to just like stop lying. Let something go. They did too much. Not getting caught up. You feel me? Because of this, they're being seen. It's being all exposed to a sword. And the eight of cups, G. You're going to be able to walk away from something. Justice card. Walk right into your justice, see? This is crazy. This is like somebody deciding to stop procrastinating and walk away and you get justice. This is like somebody fighting tooth and nail to try to find any plot, any way, any scheme to try and possibly not pay you, not be seen, not be exposed. But they have no choice. It's already been exposed. The sun is out, bitch. So somebody's going to have to walk away, and this is your justice. Okay? What's justice going to look like? We got the page of pinnacles again, G. <clears throat> the two of wands in the tower. We have the four of swords energy. There's some type of opportunity, money or something coming towards you in the future after healing from some type of exhausting thing where people was taking action to try to make something. Do, it's not going to work, right? But with the Page of Pentacles to the Two of Wands to the Tower, your justice is this something, some type of future plan, something coming out that they knew would come out. Kept seeing the Page of Pentacles. They were doing divination. On the future, in the tower, well, what's the, it was in the future? Because I remember in a reading they kept spying and looking and divination if, and to see if what they were doing was going to cause some type of future thing. <laughs> what what did they look into in the future with the two of wands? <clears throat> That's going to be a tower judgment. Like they being eight of coins, they're being real fucking, they're being real fucking quiet about this shit. 
somebody was really working hard to block you, block your finances, make something hard for you, four of swords energy, nine of coins, the nine of cups of world, the seven of cups, the seven of swords. So this person knew that they were going to be judged in the, in, the, in the future. They knew judgment was coming and they were still doing this. That's crazy. <clears throat> but with judgment, Virgo, they're looking into how... Something is going to disappear. Some type of deadlock. Something is going to be freed up for you. Flowing energy. Yeah, the rain come down. Okay. So this is what I got here for you. If you resonated with anything here, please give me a like, comment down below. Subscribe to the channel. See what's coming up next with Virgos. And you already know, I'm very grateful and thankful for everybody watching. Peace.